We'll start off with the, the sexy position, the quarterbacks, the big money makers. We've got Jordan Love currently at QB 10 or CJ Stroud at QB 14. And uh, Eric, why don't you start us off here since you're the guest of honor? Man, I'm the guest of honor and I get to show off my blatant Texans homerism. Um, for for me, it's, it's CJ Stroud. Um, he did finally throw his first interception of his NFL career last week. But, uh, you know, apart from that, his record has been absolutely sterling. And, and the thing that, that really, uh, kind of breaks the, breaks the tie for me is, is just the, the passing volume, right? Like CJ Stroud has attempted over 200 passes already on the season. And we, we don't see Jordan love throwing the ball quite that much. Right. So, you know, projecting out for the next math is hard, like 11 or 12 weeks, um, you know, I'll, I'll go with the guy who's, who's going to sling the, sling the rock a little bit more. Mm -hmm. What about you, Jake? Well, you know, I put this one in here very purposely to have Homer versus Homer to kick this thing <laughs> off with the Texans guy versus us two Packers. But look at me siding with the Texans guy in this scenario, because welcome aboard. Yes, Jordan Love, even when playing actually terrible for real life, has been okay even in those instances for fantasy. But I don't know how sustainable it is. I don't trust their offense like in general right now. Whereas Houston, aside from arguably their running game, is clicking very well. And all that does is bolster CJ Stroud. Now, yeah, I don't expect him to come out throwing 50 times every game for the foreseeable future. But when you've got that cavalcade of, of weapons around you as well, uh, and even I have to give some props to Dalton Schultz, uh, who, who I was not a fan of coming into this season either. Yeah, I think C.J. Stroud is a much safer guy, and I think they have similar ceilings. Yeah, I'm going to make it a threesome here, uh, going with Stroud as Ooh. well. Uh, I know. I let's. Just, he's looked really good to start the season. Uh, let's be honest here. And and we all knew Jordan Love with his hot start was not going to continue that and was going to kind of regress to the mean, which we've seen over the last couple weeks. We knew there was going to be growing pains in this offense. Um, so, yeah, give me Stroud, the guy that I think has the higher upside uh, for the rest of the season here. Look at us. I Look know. at us all wow. being in agreement to start things. Now let's shake some shit up. Let's everybody start fighting on this next one. 